What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. You might notice that I am not filming on my camera. I'm filming, well, I'm holding the camera. I'm filming on my phone. I'm not wearing a lav, so I do apologize for the audio. Hopefully it's not too bad. Um, I'm, I don't know if I'm really gonna edit this that much either. I might just put it out. Anyways, tonight is a special occasion. That's why I'm filming a video because tonight is the last night I'm staying in the apartment I've been staying in for the last 100 days here in LA. So I just wanted to do a little video like I did at the beginning when I first got here, I did a LA apartment tour. That was really cool to do, you know, a little bookmark. So this is the other end of that journey in LA. I will be going back to Indiana, but I won't be going back the same, man. I'm going back with new experiences in the work industry, in the film industry, such a great experience this was. So shout out to my school, Taylor University, for letting me do this. This was great. Now, uh, I guess I kind of want to take you around the apartment, see if anything's changed since that initial video I did. I mean, since then, I've had two roommates living with me. I won't show a lot of their stuff just because I don't, I don't want to do that. Um, that's not my stuff. Okay, so first of all, I got me a gaming chair. You might have noticed it in some of the videos I've filmed while here uh i did not want to sit in a chair like that not all semester no 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 we can't be doing that we can't be doing that we gotta we gotta have some comfortability so yes uh this is my calendar i was given my parents gave it to me to keep track of the days and yes we are on day 100 uh i leave here on 103 but 104 technically i'm getting on a plane at like 5 a.m just like when i came out here to be fair but anyways uh, yeah, so this is kind of my desk area, as you can see. I actually didn't do that much here, I'm gonna be honest. I mean, look at this desk. It's It was here when I got here, it's just not very good. So I've, I've literally not been sitting here that much. However, I'll get to where I where I have been uh, working when I work here, because one of my internships is online, so I tend, I spend at least two of my intern days here in the apartment all day working. I did today. Anyways, because today's Tuesday. Uh, yeah, this is my drying rack. Gotta be honest, did not use it at all. I think I used it once, but th that's because, that's because, let me bring you over here. I'm skipping a couple things. This thing, oh, I can't wait to not use you anymore. Watch this, guys. If I press this on, yeah. Okay, let's say I want to do a normal, normal uh, load of laundry, right? All right, cool. So, so see here, see here, we'll go normal, right? Okay, it's gonna take an hour, an hour and four minutes. That's not bad, right? Well, that only washes it, right? So if you wanna dry it too, you have to add the dry, uh, uh, you know, the dry, see, dry. That's what gets it dry, right? Seven and a half hours. Are you nuts? Bro, that's insane. That's ridiculous. So that's what I've been dealing with all semester. Three people having to share this one washing machine slash dryer. Nuts. Anyways, most of the kitchen's probably the same. I, my air fryer, I don't remember if that was out when I first showed you guys around. But yes, uh, I got some oven mitts and some kitchen supplies so that I can uh, do my cooking. This thing has been a pain. Not to mention this. Bruh. This is still ridiculous. Like, am I a joke to you? This is ridiculous. Anyways. Yeah, so that's pretty crazy. Fridge is pretty stocked with stuff, everything you need, that's enough for that. Uh, I don't really use much of the fridge, but yeah, that's the fridge. Um, not much has changed there, got some of my food up there, but again, that's the same. Uh, don't forget to comment what your favorite type of potatoes are. Um, I think since I've been here, I think it's changed for me a little bit. I love sweet potatoes now, more than I think I did prior, so shout out sweet potatoes. Um, I'm not gonna show their desks, but this is the TV with the, my roommate got uh, this TV stand somewhere for free, I think. Like that's nuts. And now I don't know what he's gonna do with it because apparently we're, when we move out, we're not allowed to leave anything that wasn't already here. So I don't know. Uh, anyways, uh, let's, go, let's go back here. So yeah, cabinet, I literally have kept, uh, well, I keep all my nice clothes in here. Although I gotta be honest, I haven't had to wear uh, super, like nice, nice clothes this whole semester, which has been great because I love rocking me shorts. 
sweatshirt's fine and underneath short sleeves of course you know your boy anyways yes yeah, so i got my towel in here uh this is just for like a hand towel to dry my hands the bottom the bottom is my area i've got all my uh, laundry soaps and stuff like that down there and then my laundry basket where i uh well you know you know what a laundry basket's for come on if you don't well i don't know uh yeah the bathroom hasn't really changed to be honest it's about the same i got my stuff here some of my roommates uh toothbrushes and stuff but yeah you know hasn't really changed that much um literally looks the same you know still got the perv window as i said in the first video so you know um yeah no it hasn't been that bad but you know uh it's an interesting design choice and it was actually kind of a cool design choice and in, in my opinion because you not because of, uh, it's pervy it's not pervy it's tinted enough that no one could but it's nice having like the sunlight shine in when you know in the morning anyways that that's enough about showering uh yeah so this is still pretty much the same again that's kind of their clothes and whatever i'm on this side so got it literally hasn't changed oh, this is probably what it looked like when i i don't even remember what it looked like when i showed it to you guys originally but it probably looked like this i'm not gonna lie um but yeah it's all pretty much the same just got you know towels up here day clothes here and then pjs down here but yeah sick um, that's just my jacket. Oh yeah, I didn't have this when I first did this video. My Friday the 13th sweatshirt that I got at Warner Brothers on the Warner, Warner Brothers Studio Tour, which was sick. That was probably one of my favorite parts. Even though I've done that before, it was still awesome to do because DC and I guess horror too. Anyways, yeah, my TV I've literally used once. I, I'm not even joking. I've used it one time. Yeah, this is kind of my, my stuff here. That's... Uh, Obviously books, that's not me. <laughs> that's not me. I don't read. Anyways, yeah, this is my bed. Nice bed. I think that's probably the same. I bought this little thing, which has been great. Oh, yes, that's right. It brings me back to, okay, I said I don't work at the desk, right? Well, I work here. I work in my bed. I literally wake up in the morning, grab my computer out from under my bed, put it on my lap, and I work. Literally. Because I, I can. It's great. I love working online. That's something I've learned because uh, I get to work from the comfortability of my living place. Do I have to drive somewhere and be somewhere for eight hours and then drive back? No, I do not. Anyways, yeah, that's been great. I got to be honest, though, in the last couple of weeks, I have not been working in my bed. I've been working out at the kitchen table just because it's it is easier to operate like a map, my mouse and stuff like that. And yeah, I guess that's pretty much it for this apartment tour. It's been fun. It's been, it's been a good time out here. I have overall enjoyed the experience. Like I said at the beginning of this video, getting to meet people um, that actually work in the industry and learn so much about what the industry really is I, that I didn't realize before. It's definitely made me think a lot about what I want to do. And thank you guys for checking out the video. If you checked it out and you're at this point in the video, Please feel free to subscribe, hit that like button and the bell. We are trying to get to a thousand subscribers right now and we are so close. Also, please go check out my most recent videos. They're not doing well and I don't know why. Godzilla vs. Kong, the trailers from the original Godzilla vs. Kong movie did insanely well. Some of my best videos on my channel, but the newest trailer that dropped that I reacted to, not doing so well. So please go check it out for me. That would be great. Same thing for Reverse Hide and Seek. Trust me, it might sound, maybe it doesn't sound that cool. I can understand that, but it's a video from three years ago. I thought I might as well edit it and put it out. And trust me, it's actually pretty good. It's genuinely a good video. I think it's pretty good. Spent many hours on it. So please feel free to go check that out. I'd love you to check that out. And Scream 2 just got through the copyright. Let's go. So it should be coming out soon. I just got to double check that it doesn't get claimed, you know, in a day or two so that, you know, it's for sure going to last on YouTube. I can't wait to see what happens next. Can't wait to go back to the cold climate of Indiana. Woo! I am on break. I'm gonna live like a king by doing my thing. Hey, I am on break. I'm gonna live life free. I'm gonna do it like me. Yeah, yeah. I am on break. No, this is not fake. I'm just chilling on break.